We're at CES 2015, and both these guys are going to try out the new iTech multi-user TV tracker. So they step up to the circle. It's got four of the new AI cameras in the bottom. Does a quick calibration using those colored circles. And now wherever they look on the video, it tracks exactly where they look. So what do you guys think? I can't believe you got it done without glasses. That's absolutely incredible. Uh, I'm what? an engineer, so I'm analyzing how, how it was done, of course, and it's extraordinarily technically impressive. So you guys really did an amazing job here. What do you, what do you think uh, the applications could be for gaming or digital signage? Uh, well, uh, I mean, digital signage would be, uh, like, you're talking like in a TV, like, uh, yeah, someone walks by and, yeah. Oh, okay, yeah, sure. I mean, well, the, uh, the, 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 the targeted advertising is, is obvious. Uh, for gaming, uh, yeah, I mean, the, one of the first things you think when you look at this is, wow, you can make a game out of that. Uh, and I, I mean, um, the, I first heard about Geese Detection, actually, when I got the new MacBook Pro. Uh -huh. And I was doing a video chat with a friend, and... I noticed for the first time that it didn't look like he was staring at my chest. It looked like he was staring at my eyes. Right. And I was like, how did they figure that out? And I start Googling and that, and I, I come across gaze, gaze detection. And uh, I was like, that sounds cool. I might want to try that someday. Cool. <laughs> uh, 